when you when you did this film? Yeah, we did this film. We finished it like four days ago. So um, we just finished it up recently. And um, we thought of the idea this December. We thought, what if we could make just a short, condensed version of the past nine years of this journey and try to get it to go viral, try to get it to people. You know, the goal was 500,000 views for the year. That's what we wanted. <sighs> and as you know, it's been over 10 million in two days. So. People are waking up to their power and their potential, and we are so excited that Australia is joining the world um, in this beautiful um, story. Breaking news tonight on one of the filmmakers behind Kony 2012. That's the viral video about Ugandan warlord Joseph Kony. Well, the man behind it has been picked up by police and taken to the hospital today. An official familiar with the case confirms that Jason Russell, who you see there, just on CNN last week, was found in his underwear running through the streets of San Diego yesterday, screaming and acting irrationally, and it appears it went downhill from there. So I thought I would make this video in sequence to my um, dislike for this whole Stop Coney campaign. Um, the reason why that I'm against it is because, well, I think it's a bunch of bullshit. Now, I am 100% Ugandan. Both of my parents were born and raised in Uganda. And I tend to visit there from time to time. Last time I went was in the summer of 2010. Now, when I went there, we had problems with the Al-Qaeda terrorist group, not the LRA terrorist group millions and millions of views and it's about Uganda and Kony so I asked my mom and my mom laughs and goes he died like five years ago and I asked my dad and he's laughing about it and he goes why are we talking about this and the reason why is because Kony's army group formed 22 years ago when my parents still lived in Uganda and they did their worst over 10 years ago and they haven't struck again in six years. So, why is this video being put out now? And the whole thing is to stop, Coney. So, before you go out and you're like, Stop Coney 2012 and change your Facebook profile picture and make all these tweets about Coney, you should probably educate yourself. I mean, you shouldn't base it off of one YouTube video that a guy makes $90,000 a year for making these videos. He doesn't make it because he flies around the country and feels bad and decides he's going to sit at home and make this fantastic video to hope to make the world a better place. No, he is making a great living off of this. So... I just really want people to educate themselves. Like, I think it's great to become aware of things, but this is something that's being blown out of proportion. And the people who are doing it and who started it are making a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of money off of this. And a lot of money off of us. So, yeah, just, like, educate yourself. Woo, but go Africa. I mean, I love Uganda. It's a beautiful place. If you want to go visit it, it's fun. But um, go for the right reasons.